Hello ladies and lads and welcome to the baby patch. If you're new, welcome. If you're not new, welcome back. I'm Dee and this is my adult doll channel and not meant for children. These dolls are for collectors only and not meant to be play toys. To find other collectors and channels, please click on the names in the comment section of this video. Today is hashtag casual fun Friday hosted by Kitty and sometimes Toddy at Little Waddle Nursery. It's also Thankful Friday, and that's hosted by Tammy over at Tater Tots Nursery. Both of those are beautiful channels, and uh, if you haven't yet, go please go check those out. Um, and today and every day, I'm thankful God's given me another chance to grow old. There's so many that never got that chance, and uh, I just, I just, I'm just thankful I did. I'm also thankful for my freedom. Um, I personally, I don't think we're going to have that much longer. Um, <laughs> uh, anyway, um, and today we have a little troublemaker of the nursery, Sammy, my beautiful boy. My brother calls him the, uh, uh, what is it, uh, like a stand-in <laughs> for, for a baby. Uh, but anyway, um, Sammy's the Beno Sculpt by Linda Scherer. He's 19 inches long and weighs 7.6 pounds. He has three-quarter limbs on a doe suede body. He has blonde combi hair and beautiful blue glass eyes, rooted lashes, and he can take a magnetic pacifier. And today, Sammy has been in this little romper. I got this little romper from uh, Tammy over at Tater Tots Nursery. If you ever get the chance to buy a box of her clothes, she sells them uh, pretty often. Uh, but if you ever get the chance to buy a box of her clothes, uh, do so. She she al she always has beautiful uh, baby clothes in them boxes. Uh, but anyway, today we're going to put Sammy in a pair of shorts and a t-shirt, and I'm hoping it'll fit him. That t-shirt looks awful big. But it's a, a white t short sleeve t-shirt um, with thin uh, gray stripes on it and a little gray dinosaur. I don't know what kind of dinosaur this is. But anyway, it has little orange, uh, well, a mustard yellow stripes on its back. And it has a pair of mustard yellow shorts with uh, little cuffed legs and a little white drawstring, faux draw, drawstring around the waist. And this outfit is by Child of Mine. And it's a size zero to three. Yeah. But anyway, uh, oh, and I'm going to put these uh, little gray socks on him. Has a little green dinosaur, and it says Roar on it, with these little uh, white high-topped leather crib shoes. Well, let's say walking shoes. They have a, a leather bottom on them. I got those shoes for Cody Bear. And then uh, Christy sent a pair with him. So I'm like, well, maybe Sammy can wear them. I tried them on him last night. And yeah, he could wear them. They're a little wide. I don't see how is the way his foot's made, but they just got a little bit of room, don't they, buddy? Compared to ones he has on, I think I've been wearing uh, buying his shoes too small because I have to like force them on him, and I I, I need to stop doing that. He's had this outfit on for. Seems like forever. <laughs> uh, let's see what's been going on. Well, hubby's gone to the grocery store before. Our refrigerator quit in the RV, so a new refrigerator for it cost four thousand dollars. Well, we don't want to do that, and then. Uh, if you get a 
residential refrigerator, like one that goes in the house, it's $1,500. And then to fix it, which there ain't nothing hubby can't fix, but to fix it is like $5 <laughs> for some tape. He already has the part that's supposed to fix it. So uh, he's that's what he's going to do today when he gets back from the from the grocery store is uh, go down there and dicker around with that. And me, I've been out of dishwashing liquid for days, which we, we hardly ever cook anyway, but it's just the little things like spoons or forks or knives or a bowl here of cereal or a bowl there for something else, you know, and throwing them in the sink the sink's starting to get full. So, anyway, he had to go get some stuff. And that's what I'm going to be doing is cleaning. I get sick of cleaning. I mean, I don't do it a lot. But what I get sick of is you spend all day cleaning. And then you spend the rest of the evening watching hubby mess it up. You know how that goes. Oh, look at you. How cute you look. Okay. Oh, the stunt baby. That's, that's what my brother calls him. The stunt baby. <laughs> my brother's got one heck of a sense of humor. But that's what he calls Sammy. I think he likes him. My sister wanted him. I'm like, no, just about any baby I got, but not my, not my Sammy. He was my first um, reborn. Oh yeah. There we go, buddy. Those look good. I hope it cools off with y'all. It, it rained here this morning. Oh, I don't think these are supposed to be tied. And it cooled it off a tad. But it didn't take it long after the sun came out to heat right back up. My allergies are killing me. Sorry about that. I do fine until I have to hold my head down. Then my nose starts running. I hope everybody's doing good. Enjoying your summer. I know it's hot, but... I don't know. I could always find a way to cool off. I never can find a way to warm up when when once I get cold. I've been seeing people getting some awfully pretty babies. Makes me want a couple of them. <laughs> I would love to have the uh, pickle if I knew where, you know, I, I'm out of room for sleeping babies. I can always find room you know, to put up another shelf for uh, awake babies. But unless I set a sleeping baby in a car seat and pretend like it's gone to sleep, you know, that's the only thing, only thing I know to do with another sleeping baby. And I guess that just about does it for us today. My little uh, feral cats came back and it wanted me to pet it and <laughs> it, I don't know if it scratched me or, or that's teeth marks. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure um, it didn't, it wanted to bite me, but it didn't. And that's how it done that. Uh, oh, let's see what else. Yeah, I guess that's about all. 
Hubby and I don't have any plans to go anywhere. Well, we're supposed to go to, I'm, yeah, well, we are supposed to go to South Carolina. And uh, my little granddaughter's birthday was in June. Well, her brother's birthday is in August. So I wanted to split the difference because traveling just kills my back and my legs and feet anymore, especially in that car. So I wanted to go in the middle of August, I mean the middle of July, and take them their presents and have a birthday party for both of them. I mean, hers would be late and his would be early, but still they would, I would be there for, you know, one of them, for, for them both or whatever you want to call it. Because I hate to give pre. I, I always, my problem is I hate giving presents to one and leaving the other one out. So I figured, you know, give, get, uh, give them both their presents, their birthday presents at the same time and meet their birthdays, you know, in the middle is what I'm trying to say. I always thought that was a good idea. I haven't tried it yet, but I'm going to this year, see how it goes. And if it don't work out, then I'll know better next year. Um, I, I'm really leaning toward just mailing on to them. I don't know yet. I mean, that's what I did with their Christmas presents. I always hate traveling in the winter time because I, I just know I'm going to get stuck somewhere. And, you know, you, you <laughs> people don't want you to move in with them just because of the weather. So, okay. And, well... There's Sammy. <laughs> I love him. He's such a pretty boy. Him is. But uh, I guess that does it for us. Everybody take care of each other, love each other, respect each other, and always be kind. You never know what somebody else is going through. Plus, it says a lot about what kind of person you are. Stay safe, stay well, and stay blessed. And we'll see you in your next video. Bye.